Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. For those out there that do not know me, my name is Alicia and I am a special events uh, professional. And today, um, and I first got my feet wet in the industry by um, starting off at a prestigious law firm, working in the media and catering coordinator department before transitioning into my current position as a special events uh, coordinator. And outside of those things, I do enjoy... Um, hosting my own leisurely weddings and, I mean, my own leisure events and stuff like that, such as holiday parties, birthday parties, and also volunteering my time. So I know I was a little rushed, and I know it seems very excited, but for those out there that do not know, or, you know, they're they're um, hosting their own um, wedding or event, and they want, like, a very unique and exquisite place did you know that landmark weddings were a thing? And I know a lot of people, they only know about what actual wedding venues, like it has to have a wedding in it so they know that it is an actual venue because they won't look at these other different places because they just don't know about it or they don't think that it's a wedding venue. But a lot of places around you are wedding venues. So this, all I did was type in Google, landmark weddings, and look at all the stuff that pops up. So what you're going to want to do to find your next landmark is literally in Google. Just type landmark wedding venues near me. So let's do that. And see what type of unique places um, pop up. And... You know, your guests want the uniqueness. They want to be able to go places and be like, oh, my gosh, I did not know that this was a uh, wedding venue. Or, oh, my goodness, I've always, I've driven past this place so many times. I've never been inside before, but I just, you know, I, know, I recognize the place. And I'm just, I, you know, when people recognize places and they've never been inside and they're always wondering what the inside looks like. And so finally their uh, low-key wish gets uh, granted that they get invited to an event inside of this place, this mystery place that they've been passing uh, for years or days or weeks now. And now they're finally getting access to the inside. They, Your guest response is going to be um, increased, not even increased. Like the people that you invited, a lot of them are probably going to come because and, you know, be Googling what the inside of the place looks like because they just like they're very excited and you know pictures really can't capture the whole room so now they're really excited to come to your wedding not just because not just to celebrate you or not even just your wedding not just to celebrate you or what's going on but they are intrigued they are excited they are jumping up and down low key uh to see what the inside of this place looks like so um so we're going to click on this website right here, landmarkvenues.com. And this is just, you know, look at this. This is all the different places. So we're just going to click on the first one, the Liberty House in uh, New Jersey. Just so you guys can kind of see what I'm talking about when I say the uniqueness of everything. You see like the picture with the girl on the red uh, couch looking like people love stuff like that. Like that's like so unique and so different. And, you know, this little setup out here with the bar, with the bar stools and the cabanas, like this is all amazing, breathtaking views. And then with the giant chess boards, like this is something that your guests are going to remember forever. They are going to remember this. They're going to take in the whole scenery. They're going to take in everything. And then if you decide to have um, a night function here, as you see, like, in how it looks at night. So, you know, being by a landmark at night and, you well, different times of the day is very breathtaking because you're seeing it transition from daytime to nighttime. So this is just like, wow. Um, let's just click something else. I'm just literally clicking random stuff just so just to give you guys a um a view. So let's just click on weddings and you know 
uh, different places have different um, packages. But as you see, like how they're outside and with the city as the background, it's just a lot of nice angles. I'm trying to go back. So um, let's look at the Hudson House in Jersey City. So as you see, it's already a nice view. Let's look at the grand ballroom. So let's look at what the inside of this place looks like, just to give you guys an idea. See, stuff like this is very, very intriguing. Just the different views and the size of the room and um, just the different places and the, the, the architectural design and stuff like that. So never rule out a landmark. And yes, landmark weddings are an actual thing. I'm showing it to you. Um, see like this right here is very, very nice. You see like the unique chandelier. See, this is, you will not, you're not really getting this in the traditional, um, wedding venue. As you see like the squares on the ceiling with the, um, chandeliers and the open space and stuff like that guests want to experience stuff like this and don't get me wrong if you if this is not in your type of budget don't that's okay okay that is okay if you can't find something a historic landmark within your budget don't listen do what you gotta do but i'm just giving you an alternative option in case you were like <sighs> All the wedding venues in my area are booked and I don't know. And, you know, so this is just to give you guys kind of like a option. And even if you don't want to have your wedding here, you can have your uh, engagement dinner here. You know, the engagement dinner at a historic place where it's a smaller amount of people, your groom's uh, immediate family and um, not your grooms, but your spouse's immediate family and your immediate family. You guys can rent out like a unique um, room and like a mansion or somewhere and have dinner or whatever the meal is that you want to have. This chef's room looks amazing just from like the little thing. But um, look at that chandelier. Look at the openness of the window. You can see inside of the kitchen from that. You can smell the food that the chef is preparing. You can see the huge size of that kitchen. And you see everything's nice. This is what that kitchen looks like. Huge. And you're able to experience that right in the next room. Okay, right in the next room. This is something I would recommend for engagement dinners, like I said, or very if you're having a very small wedding party, you know, bring them to a nice historic place. This is something that is is nice and something that'll be remembered forever. Let's look at one more room in this place. Um, I want I want to find a good one. So let's look at the coach's house. Look at the look at the chandelier. Okay, look at that, and look at how it is with the wedding, the um actual ceremony and stuff. Like the chandeliers just add that special touch. It's eye catching. Uh, your guests are just going to be intrigued by the whole setup of the room, and it looks beautiful absolutely beautiful so don't rule out and look at the bar like that's where that's where your guests really are going to enjoy themselves at the bar and i'm not just saying that you have a lot of, a lot of drinkers that enjoy a drink but just the shape of the bar and the chandelier hanging over the bar is definitely going to be uh, a night to remember because they're going to not only be taken back by the bar area and the shape and the uniqueness, but the chandelier just really adds to it. Like, this is a very beautiful property that I just showed you all. Um, I might show you... Let's look at the farmhouse, and then you guys kind of get the idea. Like, this stuff, stuff like this, outdoor gardens and ceremony areas, your guests are going to not know what to do. And even if you just book out one of these landmark places for pictures... That's something that, that will be well taken. And as you see the, how the ceremony is right here, 
like amazing absolutely amazing and um they have a schoolhouse like you know this is history right here so this is what a schoolhouse looked like um let's see back in 1839 so not only are they taking in the property but they're also learning and and uh just everything 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 and they're just wow a schoolhouse this is what the schoolhouse looked like back then so you know they're going to be wanting to look inside or you know speak with people that uh operate the property if they're present to learn more so not only is this a uh engagement type of thing where they're learning or they're coming out to celebrate or to you know party it up or have a great time but they're also taking this as a learning experience so landmarks are also a learning experience for your guests and that's what they're going to uh take from your from your gathering not only are they going to take in everything else but they're going to take that educational moment and apply and you know educate somebody else about that um that experience and then you got the kissing tree so definitely do not rule out the landmarks so i hope that you enjoyed this video i hope that you all uh take a look at some of your local landmarks in your area just again by going on google and typing in landmarks near me and i hope that you all find something even if you again don't have it at uh, have your actual wedding ceremony or maybe your um yeah, if you don't even have your actual wedding ceremony or reception there, at least you're able to have um, like a small engagement dinner or a small like little get together with your bridal party or something like that. So it's still you're still able to make that memory. So if you like this video, make sure that you click down below. I'll include a few links so it'll be easier for you all to find these landmarks and also get my um venues list for more venues i have a venues vendors list as well as numerous other vendors lists but i'll include the venue vendors list below this video so you're able to look into more venues and you know start putting the pieces together for your your wedding or event so until next time check out my other videos and stay safe